Welcome to the Saddleback College Library. Today we will learn about ProQuest. ProQuest is one of the general databases at the Saddleback Library. This is the ProQuest homepage. It opens on the basic search page. Below the basic search box is the subject search areas. When I search, I like to use the advanced search. You can find the advanced search at the top of the page or below the basic search box. Here is the advanced search page. I'm ready to start my search. As a distance learning librarian, I am interested in electronic textbooks. I decide on some key terms and come up with my search. In the first line, I type in textbook with the little asterisk, which is called truncation. Truncation lets the database search for all forms of a word, so it will widen my search but also keep it focused. In the next line, I keep the Boolean operator as AND and type in ebooks or electronic books, which I put in quotations. Quotes make the database look for those words as a package. I add a row and type in college or university. And I add a row again for a fourth line. I use truncation again and type in the shortened word for library. I click full text as a limiter and leave all my search fields as anywhere. Then I click search. This is the results page. I have 967 results for my search. That is more results than I'm going to take the time to look at, so I start to apply some of the filters ProQuest provides to narrow results by. I go to the side of the screen and see the results are sorted by relevance. I narrow results by source type and choose to look at scholarly journals. This changes my results to 382. Next, I scroll down the page and limit my results by date. Now I have 217 results. Let's look at those results. Number two, Oh, the Possibilities, ebook lending and interlibrary loan, looks interesting. I can scroll over the preview button to read the abstract of the article or click on the hyperlink title to view the complete article. I click on the title and look at the article. On this page, I can look at the references in this document. I can look at the full text PDF or citation and abstract. This article looks good to me, so I click Add to Selected Items, and the article shows up in My Selected Items. I click Back to Results and find some more articles. You can see my selected items are highlighted. Then I click Selected Items at the top of the page. From this page, I can delete, cite, email, print, and more. I always email myself the documents. ProQuest is a great database and has a lot of ways to help you focus your search. Take some time to explore your options and you're going to find some great resources. Thank you for using the Saddleback Library. Please contact us with any questions you have. Visit us in the library, chat with the librarian online for a quick question, call the reference desk to speak to a librarian, schedule a research consultation, or visit our webpage at saddleback.edu forward slash library. You can even friend us on Facebook. The Saddleback Library. How can we help you?